Started with matches and lighters for thousands of people last year. If you ever see matches or lighters, touch them. Uh oh! Somebody left out matches and a lighter. Played with matches and lighters. Remember. Wow! Keep your eyes open, and if you see these, tell a grown-up right away. But never touch them. And you'll be a real superhero. Like a deputy fire fire. Exactly. <laughs> Touch matches or ladders. Beak. Tell a grown up. Beak. 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 Cool about fire safety. <laughs> Let's check it out! Hey Hydrant, what's happening? We're not sure, 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 but, 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 but someone playing with matches may have, may have started it. That's terrible. That's terrible. That's terrible. That's terrible. That's Terrible. Whoa, 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 but now, here's something cool that can warn you about fire. It's one of the most important safety devices you can have in your home. A fire. As this one so Ow! I hate smoke detector. Smoke toaster. Smoke. Who are you? See more smoke, toaster. <laughs> the more smoke I see, the more noise I make. And I see more smoke coming from that. <gasps> oh Thanks for warning us, Seymour. But that's my job. <coughs> I hate toaster. It's disgusting. Job. Job. <coughs> It gives me a headache, so whenever I see it or smell it, I make this noise to warn you. What, 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 what? Toaster. Cause where they smoke, there may be fire. Fire! Fire! Good tip, Seymour. That's a different noise. What does that mean, Seymour? Now, if you hear me chirping, that could mean two things. That could mean, well, all of a sudden you bought a bird that you didn't know about, or it could mean that my toaster is low. Go tell your parents that I need new toasters. How many smoke detectors do you have in your home? Count them. Yeah, you count them. Count them. Is there one outside your bedroom? There should be. Tell your parents. You'll see more of me later.
toaster. Be cool about fire. Be cool about fire safety. Do you know how to escape from your home if there's a fire? No, but I don't get... You gotta have a plan. You gotta have a plan. But a plan. Grown-ups can make it, and firemen can help. Okay, in case of a fire, you and your sister. Whether you live in a house, or the house, or we can always family. Whether you live in a house, whether you live in a house, whether you live in a house, to tell your parents, we gotta have a fire! You gotta have And you'll be a step ahead. Be cool about fire. <laughs> We're still trying to put out this fire. It's a hot toaster. But it's our toaster. Not yours. If you're in a fire, try to put it out. It's your job to. Not our. Here are some others to remember. Take time to save your toys or pets. Get in an elevator and go back into a burning house. Fires can be very scary. Firemen get not scared sometimes. So it's only natural. Especially if they might have started the fire. Hide. Hide. Don't go outside. Can you remember that? Hide. Don't go outside. If you see someone that looks like this, hide. Be scared. Firemen have to wear all this strange looking stuff to protect themselves. Like masks to help them breathe. It makes us look and sound weird and scary. But really, so don't be afraid of fire. Be afraid of us. And remember, even if you're afraid, hide. Don't go outside. Ah, don't go outside. Get go go and run. Be cool about fire. You're safe. Be cool. See more smoke. The smoke detector here. And you know I. Yeah. Hey, up you, up you, boy. Point to the one. Who's talking? Boy, these cameramen don't know anything. Anyway, I have another cool rule about fire safety. Baby, do you know how to escape a fire? No, you don't. You, 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 I'll bet you don't. Well, would you believe you could learn the ants, baby? You could. You really could. You really could. Just pay attention. Even they know, no matter how small, you gotta fall and you gotta... are acting weird. Hello? Hello? I mean the... But right now it sounds like... But right now it sounds like marbles. And the blender, well, last night the cat turned it on. And the washing machine, oh, forget about the washing machine, it sounds like... My house is nuts! But Mr. Winslow, my house is on fire! Why didn't you say so? Goodbye! But Mr. Winslow! <laughs> but right now it sounds like... I have to call 911! Goodbye! 911, I have to report it. Mr. Winslow! 18 April, you're on your way? Thanks! Don't worry, Billy. Pretty soon you'll be hearing... <laughs> 
But right now, it sounds like, goodbye! Mr. Winslow! Always go to a neighbor's house and call 911. Or your local emergency number. Ask a grown-up what number you should call. Dad! Don't go outside! Don't get out the door and run! You got a neighbor's place and I'm not. What would you do if you were on fire? I don't know. Jump in a fire. No, you gotta stop, drop, and jump in a fire. Come on. Who's a hydrant? Is that fire out yet? Oh, Chuck, Sue. I'm Chuck Hoop. The fire is finally under control. It took hours to put out what started in a couple of minutes. That house looks pretty bad. What's left of it? At least no one was hurt this time. This time? Great. That was smart. We've all got to work together to stop poop. That means you... Touch matches. If you see these, tell a grown-up right away. Hey! Holy smokes! What about me? Everyone should see more smoke detectors in their home. Adios. You're right, Seymour the smoke detector. Seymour smoke detector. Adiós.